And welcome back to the Silver Lining with Togoth again. Good day, Hassan. Good day. Ready to Ready sail? To sail. Yes. All right. So unfortunately, I don't know what else is here that we could even go after. I feel like we've gotten everything. Can we dock here again? I guess not. It's the Isle of Mist. <sighs> Stuffy nose. There's got to be a way past that banshee. Or ghost thinger dinger. I still think that this is what we need. Graham considers it, but then decides not to. Unfortunately, they are in. We've got the shears. I feel like I'm, like, not even close to finishing this episode. I've got so many items I have no idea about. That won't work, but if it makes you feel... The thing this is... This has that to be something. Not going to work. Now, now, hey, Graham. There's got to be. Can we grab? Ooh, ooh. Can you grab one of the hot rocks? Ooh. <laughs> Graham can. That one. Goes your quest, yeah, screw you. Whatever their precise purpose, Graham feels. Well, can I light this candle? Graham prefers not to touch. Well, no, I was gonna light the candle. It makes you oh, you know, let me try that with the fire. won't light. Why won't it light? Fond surely was a special woman. Why won't you light? Broken stupid candle. <sighs> Remember he said something though. Yeah. Someone will scream at me as to why it won't light. Tell me God to go up, it's so obvious. Yeah. Alright. Can we... A druid woman, it sounds like... The waters here are calmer than those of the sea, but they too carry that weight over them. That vague sense of storminess and unrest that has settled over the Green Isles since the tragic events of the wedding. The water is cold to the touch, a sensation that is amplified by the thick mist that embraces the forest. It's been a while since Graham was so in touch with Mother Nature herself, he realizes now that he has missed this. And even given the circumstances that brought him here, he is glad that he can revisit some of his memories of his younger years spent out adventuring in the world, often taking his rest beneath trees such as these, drinking from streams just like this. All right. I'm going to just... Can I put a pee in my ear? Ah! 
Wow, see it. Oh my god! I think I got it. That's your tip right there. Laryngitis. Oh, that has to be it. I think I got it. I think I got it. I think I got it. Scream for me, woman. Scream for me! That's right. Now! Oh no, wrong button! Ah! Ah! E! No, wait! Restore! No, wait! No! Ah! Damn it! Crap! Wrong button. I'll, uh, I'll BRB when I'm back there, folks. Welcome back, folks. I did want to notice one thing that he, I don't remember him having his book out. Excuse me. We're sorry. Can I take that? Oh wait, I think I've locked up. I may have locked up. I locked up. I locked up. I will BRB again, folks. Hey, everybody. <laughs> All right, now I know you're dying to know what my idea is. If you haven't already figured out what I'm thinking. So I said laryngitis was the tip, I think. Because uh, the hint talked about doing something to her. And so my thought here... Let's, let's go over this again. Scream for me. Ah! All right. Now, if I... Nightshade you. Oh. Hi. Um. This is harder than I thought. <laughs> That's what she said. Oh, but this? Graham seems to recall reading about this book. This really... Now, if only I could find a way to store this. Yes, we mix this with this. Yes, this this has to be it. This is the this is the ingredient. And flour look ready. Graham hopes it works. That, that, that's it. We, 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 right. A totem from the Druid's village. Crow. All right. Oh. Can I talk to you? Actual Greetings, Guardian of the Mist Forest. Be on your way, human, and do not tarry here. You mean I can't go inside the forest? No. Now go, go, go! Why, why can't I go inside the forest? Hey! Oh God! Don't. This is. <laughs> I don't. Got a little butterfly. Right. I'm sure the Morgan would love to see you carrying what seems a captive butterfly around. That'll surely change her perspective of you. It's a good idea, Graham, but... Oh. <laughs> I just thought I... <laughs> There's a little wing thing. Uh, uh, you stick? Unfortunately. Huh. So I had to figure out how to get that off. And I don't think I'm going to be passing this any farther. I think the butterfly is the key. I gotta somehow free the butterfly. Well, it, it's not like it's captured by me. It was captured in web. Hi. <laughs> All right. 
Why won't the candle light? Is there anything else I can talk to you about? Like, I, I've Good done day, some pretty Graham. cool things. Good day, Gray. The guardian of the forest won't let me pass through. Make her move! Where did she come from? The Morrigan is the guardian of the mist forest. She is fearsome indeed, and men do shake the sight of her. Beyond her in the forest is the sanctuary of nature, where the spirit resides. How can I gain entry to that forest? As you are not a druid, Graham, I doubt very much that you can. Only druids have ever been allowed within the forest, and even we go rare and do not linger long. I feel I must... There's a chance the spirit may know something of my children's plight. Can you tell me more of the Guardian? Perhaps there is some other way past her. The Guardian's appearance is, as I said, deceiving. For she delights yeah. in even the smallest of the wonders of nature. Such as so I was right there. Legends say that Morrigan and her two sister birds were fearsome enough to strike fear into the entire armies. But they are protectors of, and therefore lovers of, nature. If you can prove yourself a friend to the natural world, then you may stand the chance to gain entrance. I will continue on. Look for the sign. Yeah. What the hell's with this candle? Can that won't work, but keep. If it makes you. But then. Oh, oh, why would Graham. Oh, what? Graham consider. That was the only one that was different. I was seeing. What the hell? The art should has quite a. Graham is sure each color must have a different purpose and meaning, perhaps in relation to the symbol by which each is set. One, two, three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I wonder if these are. The, I don't know enough about the zodiac signs, but why does this one not look? He's not terribly familiar with these symbols, but Graham does recognize. Okay. He's not. He's not. He's not. He's not. He's not. The arch. Graham is. The arch. Graham. The arch. The arch. Graham. The arch. The Graham is sure. The arch. Graham is. The arch. The arch. The arch. The arch. Why would unfortunate? Why would? I don't know. Cause Graham's out of ideas. His head hurts. He's tired. That's a nap. A P. Why would that won't? Something. Something with that particular candle. Maybe I'll... Yeah. I, I know there's definitely something here. Alright, folks, I'm going to cut off, though. As always, thank you very much for watching, and please tune in the next episode of The Silver Lining. Thanks for watching, folks.